Dublin, Ireland's thousand-year-old capital city, renowned for its abundance of life and sparkling personality. A place where excitement and intrigue can be found around every corner, and birthplace to Francis Bacon, U2 and Oscar Wilde. Early morning, and adrenaline junkies start their day with a rush at Ireland's first cable wakeboard park. Perfectly poached eggs are being served at Brother Hubbard, which is at the heart of the North Dublin foodie renaissance. We're big believers in buying from our own. We bake our bread, we bake all of our cakes, we do everything in here. You can't just go for your big greasy fry up and, and be content with it. People want to be healthy. Inside Phoenix Park, tourists take a morning cycle as the wild deer curiously observe. Meanwhile, others head to Dublin Zoo to see their newest arrival. Our inspiration when we build a home for an animal is nature. We want people to think that they're in the wild and not in a zoo. Lunchtime and delicious poke bowls are being made at Claw Poke. Over in Smithfield, gamers hit the retro arcade machines at Token. At the same time, shopaholics search for gems at Dublin Vintage Factory. Dinner time, and the woolen mill serves locally produced Irish cuisine whilst overlooking the Haypenny Bridge. The idea of caring about and singing loud our provenance of our food, it's becoming right on trend now and people are beginning to care. As the sun goes down, traditional Irish music can always be heard coming from the Cobblestone, a historic music venue. This pub itself has a long history of, um, you know, being a traditional Irish music pub. You'd never come in here and find that it's quiet or anything like that. It's one of those places where you know you're guaranteed traditional music every night of the week. What will you do with your day? <laughs>